Hi everyone. This video is to demonstrate the Associate Parameters tool included with the CAD Daddy Tools for Revit add-in. Although the usage of the tool is quite simple, the problem it solves is quite advanced, so we'll need to take a little time to explain the problem. Here you see a kitchen cabinet family opened in the family editor. Notice the two separate families nested in the, fam in the master family. The doors here and here the case here. I've created two types in the master family, plain and glass. Glass is the one that's current here. The only difference between the two is the panel type that's selected. In this case, base glass panel. And in the plain, base flush. Apply that to see what the plain one looks like. There you have it. Let's try flexing our model by changing the width and the height of the master family. Change the height to 30 inches instead of 3 feet. And the width to 30 inches instead of 3 feet. Apply. See how the doors don't adjust in size? Because the parameters in the door family are not associated with the master family. Let's associate them now. Select the door, edit the type, select the width, and associate it with the master width. Select the height, associate it with the master height. Okay. Now the doors are adjusted to fit the case. You can switch between the two master types and everything appears to work correctly. Let's flex the model again, this time using the glass type. Change the width to 30 inches. Sorry, the height, the width to 30 inches. Apply. Notice that this time the panels did not adjust like they should. The reason is that you have to associate the master parameters with the corresponding parameters of each door panel type. There are seven door panel types. Only one is currently associated. Let's now take a look at the Associate Parameters tool and select one of the doors. Go to Add-ins, Associate Parameters, Select. What you'll notice first are all the columns with all seven of the door panel types. The second column, labeled Nested Family Parameter, is a list of all the parameters within the door family. Notice on the base flush type here, you can see that the door height parameter and door width parameter are associated and the rest are not. Let's associate the height and width parameter of all the door panel types by checking the column labeled Apply Changes to All Types. Press OK. Now all door panel parameters are associated with the master family parameters. Thank you for watching.